Okay. Uh, uh, it's easier to play white, maybe. Um, okay, for quick d4, try and get an e5, and then queen h5 again. Uh, we'll teach and queen d5, maybe. Or, um, or maybe not. Um, okay. <laughs> Uh, knight d2s, is that handy? That's knight c3, queen e1. Uh, okay, I'm we'll taking the knight g5. Maybe queen h5 is a threat. Um, okay, doesn't matter about the knight sack, I'll just try and get a rook in. Uh, no. Although how to get a rook in, because f4 is d, f4 doesn't look like, um, yeah, it doesn't look like it's possible to get a rook in in this position. How about bishop f6? Uh, idea, just to get a pawn on f6. Uh, so he's thinking about this one. Okay. Hmm. All right, kind of caffeine boost. So I've got my pre-move there, and then bishop f6. G6, queen g6. Okay, I'm threatening bishop f7. But apart from that, I don't know what I'm threatening. So, uh, hmm, interesting. Oh, 29 seconds if he doesn't connect. Great. Plus 16. That's good, 62. But well, there's 148 is in the lead. Going 148. I'm going 1384. Just the knight doesn't look too bad. Being a knight down. Uh, get bishop c5 in quick. And queen h4 again. Trying cheeky. Queen h4 is knight f3 going to be played. Whoops. Okay, I don't know a particularly quick way of winning this. I can just try and do lots of pre moves. Um, try and win the queen. Or just bishop b7 positional. <laughs> There's queen d7. Uh, we'll just take on e5 actually. Uh, that's sensible. Okay, just, just sensible chess here. Take and then uh, d6 bishop b7. Uh, bishop b7. Hitting the rook. We'll take on e3 next. Bishop c6 first. Okay. That b5 b4. Let's try and uh, undermine that knight. Or h6, just to give my king a bit of air. And when I, oh, I'll take on e3 first. So b4, and um, although that looks fairly dangerous, both rooks on the seventh. Uh oh. Um. Okay, so given that I won't set the knight, I'll just get back to G to, to protect G seven. Subalts will move. <laughs> okay, what do I do with my other rooks? I can take here because F seven, but then maybe H six is important. Um, I'll get back to the first rank, I think. I'm gonna try and queen my pawns here. If I win this pawn, uh, not yet. 
clicked on that G7. Okay. So I don't know how to get out of this. To wait for rook a, a rook move. We'll just try and win on time. Uh. Uh oh. Knight D5. What about rook? I don't know rook here and then rook G2 if knight moves. Rook G2. So that would uh, cause alarm um, if it was in the right position. Uh, uh, A4 cause confusion, but A3 actually sort of mating there. Idea. Uh, so what's what's the idea? Um, whoops. out of time anyway. Okay, so I'm on 80 but the leader's on 188. This is not looking too hot. 26 minutes left. I'm not getting many quick wins. <laughs> um, I'm going to try something extremely radical here to get a quick win. Um, although Queen H4 is a bigger threat. I might Queen B3. That could be an opportunistic win. And B7 is a problem. Oh, 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 I mean, I'm in a bit of luck. Oh, plus 20, that was a bit of luck. But I'm still 88 behind. 88 behind, 25 minutes left. <clears throat> and the kind of fence, okay. Oops. And he's going for it. Um, am I going to get stuffed that Kepper? I hope not. I can take on c4, e5. This isn't a total disaster. I like our defense with some bite here at odds. But how do I turn this into a quick win? We get knight d4 in or queen b6. Queen b6 would be annoying. Um, that diagonal. b2, weak. Right, let's think. d6, bishop g4. The stakes are getting higher. There's a glimmer of hope that Whoa! He just resigned. Plus twenty. Plus twenty. So the leader's on one eight eight, so sixty eight away. Okay. Um try quick I don't know. It doesn't quite do the job. What about F four? F four, just sacrifice um E four if D five, okay. And then for F five and uh, with a nebulous attack um, or non-existence. Uh, um, okay, uh, what about bishop b2 though? Bishop's on both diagonals. Uh, so obviously g7 is a, is a mating opportunity here or knight h5. First to get onto that g7 square. Oh, it's a from quest. So um, I don't know, I don't know. Okay, if I prompt a knight takes pawn please <laughs> knight takes pawn uh oh uh nope that didn't happen okay uh let's go back to the drawing board here what opportunities are there um i can get this rook in e3 h3 let's just get the rook in oh, knight e fours I think rook h3 is the most uh, promising here. Now for a quick knockout. Um, though that's not likely to happen after bishop g7. Uh oh. Um, let's get this. If knight e2 is check and is winning my bishop. Oh no. That's a shame. That didn't happen. Okay. So now I'm threatening knight g6. Or bishop d4, bishop e6, knight g6. Nope. Um, let's get the king out of here. This knight e2 is really getting annoying. <laughs> okay. So, I don't know, knight g6 here. Or knight h5. Get a pin. Not much. Not too many choices. Uh, 
was 18, 19. Um, oh dear, it's got Bishop H3. This isn't working out particularly, uh, particularly well. So G4, huh? So, um, no, this is not good. <clears throat> okay, okay. Let's not panic about this just because I'm losing this horribly. What about h4, h5? Cavalry, pawn cavalry is coming. So if I can get an h6, isn't that remotely dangerous? I don't think so. Um, if I can get in uh, g6, uh, um, what about bishop e4? Or g6 here, and bishop e4, or queen e4? Queen e I'm going to take here anyway. No, I can't. Let's check. Oh, oh the solidity continues and continues. And I can't even win on time because I'm getting absolutely munched. Uh, Rook was in pre there, but. Oh, sad ending. I think I'll resign that. Yep. Let's move on. Oh, the, the lead is on 2 2 2 now. So. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm going to catch this up. Oh dear. Yeah. Uh, a bit of luck a few, for a few games, but it doesn't look too promising now. Uh, it was knight d5. The, the old trap. Knight d5, which he hasn't gone into, of course. <laughs> um, uh, there isn't a trap here, is there? So... Uh, let's try and just castle f2 whoops oh good good win 20 20 so trying to get trying to get up there quickly I need some f2 accidents um, so knight f3 may be confusion effects on knight f3 there's always queen b3 with the c pawn there missing Okay, there's always e5 as well. Okay, there's always uh, bishop g5 or queen h4. Uh, bishop, maybe, maybe uh, support e5 first. A bit of overprotection. Then queen h3, knight g5. Um, I think maybe bishop takes is uh, unfortunately uh, and this is 96 now I'm not, I'm not really sure 96 and bishop h takes oh, I think I'll take okay so what about hopefully g5 nope okay uh, if I take on h6 take on h6 I'm trying to get in knight g5 um, I have knight g5 now, just to speed things up. So then bishop g7 friends, h8 and h7. So, unfortunately, uh, there's an escape route. Ah, oh, which is made even worse with the king, actually. Coming over. Um, uh, okay, so I'm trying to weave a mating net with my king or something with h4. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Um, this isn't really happening, is it? Oh, knight f3 and queen e5. Um, nearly, not quite. Um, knight f3 and queen e5 here. Oh, no, nope, there's knight f3. Messed it up. Unless he plays king f5. Uh, 